Good evening. I hope I didn't keep you waiting for too long. As always, I'm Dr. Cardlin. It's great to see you again. It's been about 27 weeks since your last appointment. <laughs> it says here this is just a routine checkup and a flu shot. All right. The nurse already measured your weight, height, all that stuff. I'm going to start by checking your breathing. This thing might be a little cold. Now, just breathe in and out with me, okay? Very good. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's... That's good. That was the chest. Now the back. Just breathe. Perfect. That's... Perfect. Your hair smells amazing. Is that a new shampoo? <laughs> no, no. It smelled good before, too. But it's different now, isn't it? Like springtime. Freshness. Such a good smell. Anyway, yes, we're done with breathing. Now it's time for reflex testing. Yes, that's the knee hammer thing. <laughs> Sorry, do you mind if we move your purse over there? Thanks. I just like to have a lot of space when I work. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. All right. Well... Your reflexes are good, and I love your socks. No, really, they're great. You look great today. Every time I see you, you just get more and more lovely. Oh, nonsense. Gain weight, lose weight, that's nothing compared to the pleasure of watching someone's personality bloom. Your smile, your eyes, the way you look at the world. Is that weird? <laughs> kind of. Okay. All right. Have you had any medical concerns? Any pains or instances of weakness? Okay. Okay. Make sure to let me know anything you find troubling. I can't offer my best medical care unless you tell me absolutely everything. You're sure? Well, it's just that... Do you remember when I saw you the other day in the grocery store? You were with, uh, a certain young man. Yes, him. He's a great guy. He's also one of my patients. Yes, he comes here fairly often. If you're considering pursuing a relationship with him, or if you have already, you should know that his uh, health... Well, he's been in a lot of relationships in the past, and I'd hate to see you catch something from him that you can't throw back. Confidentiality? Yes, I know those are the rules, but... I couldn't not tell you. I just really care about your well-being. After all, I've been your physician for a while now, and... 
Oh, uh, one moment. Yes? Oh, have a good evening, nurse. I'll see you on Monday. Okay. <laughs> Where were we? Right. It's time for your injection. Let me just get my supplies here. Oh. <laughs> you used to be so scared of these. I remember you used to have to play music. <laughs> Do you want me to play you some music? No? Just get it over with? <laughs> okay. In and out. Here we go. Perfect. And you barely flinched. That brings us to our very last order of business. Paperwork. Yes, I know. <laughs> More paperwork. Here you go. I got the papers from the front desk ahead of time to save you the walk. Just uh, fill these out. That's right. Gosh, it really has been years, hasn't it? I can't get over that. You used to come here all the time for college physicals and other things, but now... 27 weeks, huh? No, I'm, I'm fine. I'm just worried that you're not prioritizing your health. After all, you don't get to pick out a new body if something goes wrong with this one. And then you worry about these things so much, it almost makes me wish that I could personally... Oh, oh there. <laughs> Your hand is shaking. Maybe you should put the pen down for a second. I'm sure, as long as you've already signed it, I can fill it out from here. I remember every appointment you ever had, after all. I've memorized... Here, just give me that. Hmm? You feel strange. Well, that's okay. Just lie back. The feeling will pass. Just from the injection, that's all. Go on. Lie back. There we go. Oh, it really does smell good. I'll have to find the shampoo. It seems to be making your hair healthier anyway. <laughs> What's that? Really? You feel weak? Oh, that's all right, honey. It's just the injection, that's all. Oh, well, that's because it wasn't a flu shot. Don't worry, I'll properly vaccinate you later. I keep a few in my fridge, but this was more important. No, 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 no. You don't need to call anyone. At any rate, you can't reach your phone. It's in your purse, which is way over there. Hey, shh. Don't try to make noise. Don't try to make noise, my dear. You're the last patient. All of the nurses have gone home for the day, and the receptionist... Well, you know how she likes to listen to her music. No one will hear you. Shh. Shh, it's okay. <laughs> Just relax. You'll be asleep very soon. Do you want me to sing you to sleep? Oh, hey... Stop struggling. <laughs> you actually headbutted my chin a little there. <laughs> mm, don't worry, sweetheart. You're safe with me. That's why, darling, it's incredible that someone so unforgettable 
thinks that I am. Unforgettable, too. You truly are, you know. Unforgettable, that is. Hmm. My favorite patient. You'll always, always be safe with me. Mm -hmm. Now, I can see you drifting off. So I'm going to go start my car and give your papers to the receptionist. Shh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'll be right back for you. I'll be right back, my dear. Mm -hmm. Sweet dreams.